This week's question comes from Billy from Greenville, North Carolina. Roger, I'm a big fan, even though I know you went to Duke. Go ECU. Here's my question. Do deer move much when it rains? All right, Billy, a pirate fan. I won't hold that against you. Uh, a quick question, quick answer. Absolutely yes. Uh, Josh and I were uh, a bow hunting in Mississippi a number of years ago, and buddy, it started to rain. I'm talking about one of them Delta rains, all right? <laughs> it rained three or four days. Uh, we were hunting with Howard Netterfield, and I remember Howard was a big old Miss fan. And about the middle of the fourth day, I told Howard, I said, is it ever going to stop raining? He said, well, eventually. I said, do you not have a ground blind somewhere you can just go stick us in? I'm going crazy. He said, well, I got one down here, but we don't ever hunt out of it. I said, take us to it. He said, right now. I said, right now. And we got out there in the middle of the day and got in that ground blind, all right? <laughs> I thought to myself, man, they're going to find us in about six months floating around in the Gulf of Mexico. I'm telling you, it was a gully washing rain. And we weren't in that blind 30 minutes. And here come a couple of bucks. All right, come right up to the blind. I think they wanted in the blind. Josh won't shoot one. He'd never killed a deer with his bow at that time. I told him, I said, now, we'll be patient. You know, we'll eventually, uh, you know, get a good buck, and we did. But I think sometimes we forget that whitetail deer spend 365 days a year, 24 hours a day in the woods. They don't get a break from the weather. And if it rains, they're still going to get up and do their thing, all right? Sometimes I think it even encourages them to move. Now, Billy, remember this. Please, remember this. I don't care if it's rained three or four days or just a couple of hours. After a hard rain, there's a little short window of about 30 minutes where the woods are going to come alive. Deer are going to get up and move for whatever reason, whether to shake the water off or stretch their legs or whatever, they're gonna move. If you're in your stand, you have got a better chance right then to run an arrow through a buck than just about any other time other than maybe during the rut. I've shot several big white-tailed bucks by just enduring the rain, getting wet, and right after the rain, the bucks move. If you do that, I promise you, you'll have a better chance to be successful.